Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Eileen and welcome to, let's see, what are we going to call this? This is going to be, what hair am I going to wear for Valentine's Day? <laughs> this is not a wig review. If you're new to my channel, first of all, welcome. I hope you find lots of fun here. I hope you find encouragement and support. I do a lot of different videos on all kinds of wigs and colors and styles. Uh, when I first started my channel, I did short blonde pixies. That was my comfort zone. Now, I just posted today my first brunette showcase. <laughs> so I went from the blondes, then I fell in love with the reds, and now I am really enjoying the brunettes. So if you are a brunette wearer, stay tuned. There are going to be a lot of those coming. But today is just going to be fun. I have some wigs I'm going to show you. And all the wigs that I'm going to show you are from Wig Studio One. So you can go over there and have a look at them. If you see one of these you want to know more about or see a full review of, that's easily done. Just go to the search box down in uh, on my channel. There's a little search box there and put in the name of the wig. And if I have done a review on it, it will pop up. And I think... I think I've reviewed the majority of these. There's a lot of new styles that have come out that I haven't gotten to yet, but stay tuned. I will. But you can see them all and purchase them all at Week Studio One. Okay, so like I said, I'm going to try these on. And then on Valentine's Day, I will post a picture uh, in my community tab of the one I chose. And I'll also uh, post it over on Instagram. So if you're not following me there, please do so over on Instagram. We got to start this out with, of course, the Eileen wig from Push Hair at Wig Studio One. Now, I have reviewed this wig. I had the original Eileen wig. This is the 14 inch that was just re-released within the last month. It is beautiful, of course. I am so honored to have this wig named for me. I can't tell you. I love it so much. I did a um, little short video where I added a lot of curl to it. Now, I have since straightened it back out because I had so many questions of, okay, you've added curl, but can you straighten it back to where it was originally? And the answer is yes. This has been straightened after it was full of curls. One hundred percent European uh, Remy human hair. It is beautiful. I love it. Uh, I like I said, I've done a video on it already, where I've shown it in outdoor lighting, the cap, everything. I'll link it below. But I, this is definitely a contender for Valentine's Day. All right, this is Raquel Welch, editor's pick, and ice cappuccino. Do you have editor's pick? Do you love it? <laughs> I have editor's pick, I think, in five colors. There's, I love everything about it. Of course, you know, I really enjoy Raquel Welch wigs. But I think these waves on this wig are just perfectly done. Beautiful length. Yeah, it's a winner. Now, this is a fairly new style. This is Henry Margu Chelsea, and the color is 12H. Longer style, beautiful Henry Margu fibers on this wig. This color is so pretty, 12H. I did a video on this and I showed it in some outdoor lighting. I thought it really showed up beautifully, 12H. Let me know if you've tried this one. Okay, this is Ellen Villa Sing in Mocha Rooted. I just got this wig. This is included in that brunette showcase I told you about. And so um, I just wanted to show it here too because this is adorable. This is so cute. I like these little wigs that are this length. Now, this right under the chin, so a lot of people can wear this. But I like these choppy layers on these wigs. I'm seeing that a lot on the wigs that are coming out. Now, I just swept these bangs over, but you could use, a, and in my brunette video, I showed you how I used a hot air brush to really bump them under and wear them straight across. So you have uh, some variety of ways you can wear this. Yeah. This 
is such a pretty color, mocha rooted. A lot of beautiful highlights, easy to wear, out of the box, fun short style. Have you tried any of these new Beltress styles? This is Newport. I've already ordered this in another color. I like it that much. This color is Raw Sugar Blonde R. This is so fun. Again, Beachy Waves. The Beachy Waves are not going anywhere, y'all. <laughs> They've been around a long time. And as you know, I was one of the very last to get on the Beachy Wave bandwagon. But I'm glad I did because now I see why they're so popular because they're just easy hair. You don't have to worry about fixing it. You just get up, spray it with some water, run your fingers through it, and get out the door. All right, another fun go-to style. Raquel Welch, ready for takeoff. This is hazelnut. I have this wig in a blonde. I have worn it so many times, but I wanted, again, to kind of show you some brunettes, so I ordered it in this color, and I think it's a winner, too. I think this is going to be one of those wigs that it's going to look good in any color. Now, go-to style put it on, get out the door, ready for takeoff. I like the longer sweeping bang across the front. I mean, it's just perfect. Has a little longer nape here, which I know a lot of us appreciate if you have hair that grows down on your neck. This is a good one that will cover that with a little bit longer nape. Lots of layers, can wear it all going forward. I like to tuck it behind one ear. It's just my way. I mean, you can't go wrong with ready for takeoff. Well, you know, I had to throw a red in here. So this is Beltress Mara Pumpkin Pie Spice R. What a beautiful color. And of course, I just, you know, love a red. This wig has such a beautiful cap. You know, of course, there's no permatease here. Long sweeping bangs. Yeah, this would be a good Valentine's hair. Now, we all have those wigs that we love that we think don't get enough attention, and that is this wig for me. Now, this is Ellen Villa Elegance Mono in Bernstein Rooted. Oh my gosh, y'all. I have shown this wig over the years, and I have ordered it two or three times. Now, I like the flip here. As a matter of fact, I added this flip with my hot air brush. You could turn this all under. You could do whatever you wanted to. I just like flippy wigs. But um, the fibers on this are incredible. The cap is just gorgeous. It has a beautiful fit. The color's good. It's just good. <laughs> And like I said, this has been around for a long time. Uh, it's not inexpensive, I will tell you that. I bought the last one I got, I got on clearance. So be sure to watch that clearance section at Wig Studio One. They change it almost every day, they update it. So be sure to watch it. I get some wonderful buys there. Here's another new style from Beltress. This is Santa Monica. Milkshake Blonde R, I fell in love with it right out of the box because I love this blunt cut. I think it is trendy, not too trendy as I tell you all the time. I think anybody can wear it. I think this is a winner. I've already ordered it in another color. I'm not going to tell you what I'm getting. You're going to be surprised, but I'll show it to you when it comes in. Movement here. Wow. You know, these City Collection and Lux Collection that came out from Beltress, I think they did an excellent job. I really do. I love that this just has zero permatease. Throw it on. I, like I said, I like the straight. I like the blunt. I like everything about it. All right. This is Amelie from Wig Studio One Push Hair. Now, as you know, I did a, a video on this wig already. Beltress and Wig Studio One did a collaboration where uh, they did some exclusive styles for Wig Studio One in some of Beltress's most popular colors. This is Brown Sugar Sweet Cream, and again, this style is Amelie. 
I love it. And what I like is it is not severely angled. Some of the wigs, you know, come down to a very severe angle. I don't like that. That's not for me, but it looks good on others, but not on me. I like this one because it is not so severe. So I feel like it's very wearable for all ages and it is sleek. There's no permatease here, and it is in the beautiful color, brown sugar sweet cream. Again, this is Amelie from Push Hair at Wig Studio One. Okay, guys, let me know your thoughts. What's your favorite of all these wigs? And on Valentine's Day, I will post it on Instagram. I'll also post it over on my community tab, but mainly I want to know what are you wearing for Valentine's Day? What have you decided your hair is going to be? So I look forward to hearing from you. Have a great day, and I'll see you next time.